So I got this Windows 11 computer in front of me and they said it was going to be totally easy. Yeah, well, um, how do I turn it off? Well, don't worry, friends. Rick Bray from the Plick team at Broomtown Gabozis here to help you out with uh, shutting down your machine. Because while Windows 11 really behaves incredibly similar to Windows 10, for me, the shutdown thing moved a little bit and it, it makes it a little different. But it's there, don't worry, and I'm here to help you out. So let's start off by clicking on that Windows icon, just like we did before. And you'll see that your name appears there as, as whomever you're logged in as. And the power button is now over to the right-hand side. When I click on power, there I get the option to sleep, uh, to shut down and to restart. Don't forget, sleep is done with the Windows L key. So Windows L is a great move in terms of uh, cybersecurity type things. It, it lock, right, is where the L comes from. It locks your computer when you walk away. So just a real quick Windows L will put it to sleep. But let's keep digging in. So with that power button, I also have the ability to restart. That's great. But what if someone's just coming into my room and, uh, and they wanna sign in real quick? Well, you can click on your picture icon and that's where I can change account settings if I want to, or probably the one that you're looking for, switch user, where someone else can sign in as me, but I'm not fully signing out of the machine. So there you go, that's how you can switch users if you need to flip between people on a device or you can click on the power button and shut your machine down. Now, quick tip, real super fast. If all you're looking to do is very quickly get into your Google account, I have another solution for you so that doesn't require you to wait for the computer to log up. I'm gonna put a little card up in the top so that way you can check that out. It may not be available to everyone depending on your district, but it is an option. So go check that out if you're wondering, but that is how you can turn off your Windows 11 machine. Thank you.